What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Scary Terry video. Guys, it has been a while, but I am excited to say we are finally getting back into the Chiller and the Shriek series on Webtoons.com. It's been a couple of weeks actually since I've last read anything from the Chiller or the Shriek series, mostly because I've been in contact with Webtoons themselves and I've been seeing which one of their stories would be cool for my channel and I've been getting different permissions from different creators to feature their stories on my channel. So just a little heads up guys, more stories, more series are coming to the channel. It's going to be really exciting and very scary. Today guys, we are going to be reading Possession by Joe young -Suk. All right, without further ado, let's begin. Turn up your volume when reading Chiller for a more immersive experience. And that's one of the things I love about Webtoons. They completely revolutionized the way you read comics with the whole vertical scrolling, as well as being able to add in music and sound effects. Now guys, just a little side note, I usually add in my own music and my own sound effects when I do read through videos like this, but there are exceptions when it's from Webtoons and the creator has taken time to actually put in their own sound effects. Then usually I'll leave most of them in there, but I still add in my own stuff just to make it extra fun. Let's begin. Possession. Story by Jo Young Sok. Assistance by Kim Dong Un. All right. It's a dark day in Seoul, or I don't know, some city in Korea probably. I just assume it's Seoul. Looks like we're taking place at a barbecue. Ooh, Korean barbecue, dude. That's what you gotta do. Damn, dude, that that chatter. That's pretty loud. Let me make that softer. Ooh, dude, that looks good. Mmm, dude, I can smell that samgyeopsal already. They got soju, dude. It's a party. It is lit. Clink. Two people's glasses touch as they make a toast. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Two friends are sitting together at the barbecue, drinking, having a good time. Now, if you guys don't know, they're drinking soju, which is a Korean alcohol. It's the most common one. It's cheap. It gets you drunk faster than beer. Some people say it tastes like ethanol. Honestly, dude, oof, I haven't gone out drinking in a while. I kind of want to go out now. Ah, I haven't had soju in ages. Hey, Youngyu, it ain't so bad, huh? Yeah, it tastes so smooth. <laughs> the boys laugh as they continue drinking. Damn, Dude, are they already on three bottles? Holy! No, dumbass, check out 11 o'clock! He tries to hide his expression as he's glancing at some beautiful girl probably behind him. 11 o'clock? Yeah, that blonde over there is totally my type. Man, she's hot. Mmm, this looks good! His friend doesn't seem to notice that he's talking about this perfect 10 over across the room. All that his friend is concerned about is the Korean barbecue. Dude, seriously? Like, what's wrong with him? How can he ignore her? Hey, Hyunwoo, the meat's ready. Let's eat. It's like you're living on a different planet. This is why I don't have a girlfriend, man. Oh, dude, look, they, they put a little heart in his eye. He's more in love with the food than he is with the hot girl. Come on. Let's go and have a drink with some girls. Why are we sitting here by ourselves? Ugh, it's like I'm cursed lately. I haven't had a girl since you, son. Ugh, this sucks. Ah, uh, dude, I like the little effect here. That's true, you haven't been with anyone since you, son. Maybe you really are cursed, ha ha ha. You'll find someone eventually. Still, whenever you're lonely, I'm always here for you. Aw, oh, what a nice friend. Just worry about yourself. Are you planning on being solo forever? Just then, click. Well, I'm just, I'm not really interested in a relationship with a girl yet. I'm happy with things now. He brings his camera up to his face and then, he takes a picture. God, would you cut that crap out? You've been doing that since high school. Dude, he looks so drunk right now, I'm, I'm just saying. His friend does not stop. Oh my gosh, dude, look at him. Look, look at this, he just keeps taking picture after picture. And another one. Ugh. And now he seems to be getting annoyed. I mean, dude, I, I would too. I mean, come on, he's not a paparazzi. Just leave the poor man alone. Hey, dude, cut it out, it's embarrassing. I said stop it, dumbass! Why the f are you taking so many pictures when it's just us two guys? Stop taking pictures before I smash that stupid camera. Hey, what's wrong with a couple of guys taking pictures? These will all be memories someday. As the two boys squabble, it seems like everybody in the restaurant has gotten their attention. Besides, I like taking your picture. Uh... Oh... Uh-oh. Hey, do you think those guys are, you know... <gasps> no way. Two drunk girls whisper to each other, contemplating on the sexual orientation of the boys. And I, for one, am actually a little bit confused as well, at least for one of the dudes. Ah, gosh darn it. He obviously heard the girls talking about him and is embarrassed. You're so f embarrassing to drink with! Ugh, I don't even feel like drinking now. The boy erupts with anger, probably getting the intention of the entire- oh! Holy crap, dude, did you- My light just freaking like, flickered and like, made a weird noise. Hi? Okay, uh, 
I think we're okay. Back to the back to the story. Dude, is it just me or is this picture like actually a picture? It actually it looks so photorealistic with the cars. It doesn't actually look like it was it was painted or drawn. Okay, kudos to the artist cuz that looks really real. It's a cold, quiet night. I wonder how they turned out. Youngyu, the friend with the camera, rides his bicycle down the street. I'd better hurry home and develop them. Ha ha ha. He rides his bike nonchalantly down the street on his way to go develop the photos. And then shoom, here we are in the red room. The red room? I don't think that's what it's called. What, what is it called? The photography photo development room that's red? Okay, whatever. We're in the red room. He's hanging photos. He's developing them. Dude, I'm pretty sure we're gonna see something here. He's been taking pictures of his friend an awful lot, dude, and I'm starting to get some vibes where he's actually into his friend. He dips the photo in the water to let it develop. Man, they look good. He grasps the photo, pulls it up to his face. <laughs> A large grin appears on his face, very creepily. Sk. He pulls up the photograph, he peers into it, and then, mwah, he kisses it. Oh, dude, I called it, dude, I called it. I knew he was in love with his friend, dude. Oh, that is so weird. <laughs> he glances at the photo. Why can't you have a girlfriend, you ask? I think I know the answer. <laughs> he glances even harder and creepier. I don't see yourself. <laughs> As he looks at the photo, Ever having one. Ever having another girlfriend? Why? Flashback. Back to another time when they were in high school. Okay. Aren't you hungry? Why don't we get a bite to eat? Sure, let's get some burgers. Ah, oh, dude, this seems to be back when they were all in high school. The man looks so happy and, and healthy here. I guess this is his girlfriend from before. And then here's, a, here's your boy, a creepy stalker in love with your best friend, dude. As they walk by, leaving their friend behind. Burgers again? Why do you like it so much? It seems like he doesn't even care that they're leaving him behind, as all he needs is his camera. I like burgers, but I like walking holding your arm even more. Aw, they're such a cute couple, ha 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 ha. They both laugh and smile so happy together. <laughs> really? Then I'll lend you my arm anytime you like. Grab onto it whenever you want. Ah, dude, he is starstruck. He is so in love with her. It really is a shame that whatever happened and ended things, I mean, well, happened. Really? Then I'll hold onto it forever. You better not tell me to stop later. Hey, guys, look over here. Huh? And then, snap. Ah, oh, dude, your man is taking pictures of them again. Even back then, he was obsessed. Kyonu, smile like you, son. Ah, not again. Stop taking pictures, you idiot. But the weather is so nice today, and you guys look so good together. Yeah, we should be thanking him. Why are you getting upset at Youngyu? He said we look great together. Still, there's a limit. He takes my picture every freaking day. Uh, anyway, let's go get some burgers. I'll buy today. All right, yeah. The two boys seem extremely happy as the girl offers to buy them their after-school snack. I mean, who wouldn't love someone like that? You're coming too, right, Youngyu? Yeah, I'm gonna come and get some onion rings too. You should be losing weight. You're not saying that about me, right? Ha 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 ha. The trio walk down the street as they go to get their burgers. Everything seemed so well and happy back then. We were enjoying our last semester of high school, together, hanging out like any normal group of friends. But this normal life of ours didn't last very long. And then, night. On a rainy night in a dark alley. Oh! Yusun was found dead, killed in an accident. Oh my gosh, dude, what? So that's how, okay, she, okay, she was killed. Uh, and after that, <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, look at his eye twitching like that. Uh, that is so horrifying and creepy, but you really got to give credit to the, uh, the, the creator and the, the editors for, for making it so, well, interesting. I became obsessed with capturing you in my pictures. <laughs> he looks at the photo of Hyonu again. How can someone so sick just be so casual about their best friend and their feelings for them like this? Click. He turns the lights off. He leaves the door. You were the only person. And we're seeing a bunch of pictures on the wall. Whoever made me smile. Wait a minute. Okay, well why, why do they have pictures of the girl? I just want you to be mine, even if only in my pictures. Okay, wait, so, I don't get it. What, does he love the dude or does he love the girl? For now and forever, 
I want to keep seeing. <gasps> that smile of yours! Oh my gosh. Dude, what? Dude, it's... Oh. Oh, dude, that sound is horrifying. Wow, so she's, that's her. She's like haunting him. But her, his friend can see him by taking the pictures of him. Holy crap. This explains so much, actually. At the beginning of the story, he was saying how he couldn't seem to find a girlfriend since you son had died, right? I haven't had a girl since you son. Ugh, this sucks. And if that's the case, then it would make perfect sense because she's with him, haunting him in her death all the time. Oh, dude, that is so creepy. I'm not looking at that anymore. That plot twist, though, man, that got me messed up. I thought he was in love with Hyonu at first, and, and now it turns out he was in love with, with Yusun, but she died, and then he's still in love with her, and he gets to see her through the photographs. And honestly, like, my dude, I, I don't know why, like, y your feelings for her haven't changed even, like, the slightest. I mean, y you know, you see her now. She's a dead, deathly ghost who's still hanging on to your best friend. Aren't you even just a little tiny bit scared that she's gonna murder you in your sleep because you're in love with her? No. Well, guys, we'll just have to leave that one up to your imagination. And that is the end of the story. I gotta say, it did have me confused and uh, did trick me at times. But uh, yeah, this was a good one. I liked it. Let me know what you guys think about this one down below in the comments. I love the Chiller series. It's on Webtoons, guys. It's completely free. If you want to read more stories in this series, click the link in the description. Again, big shout out to the original creators for giving me permission to feature their stories in my videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, feel free to leave a like, hit that subscribe button if you're new. Thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Good night.